Up. Oh, jeez. I forgot how skilled you are with your hands. We can figure the rest out later. <laughs> oh, whatever. Go for it. I'm going in. <laughs> Damn it! I fell for it again! Curse my Rizzler. Whoa. Ooh, Harley Quinn and Catwoman all in the same room. All right, let's get it. What's up, YouTube? It's me, Slow, and thanks for slowing down with me. If anything, today we're jumping into Batman's The Enemy Within, Episode 3. Honestly, seeing Harley Quinn get captured in the last episode was a little brutal, um, but I was not going to let those three agents get destroyed by Bane because that seemed a little crazy. So without further ado, let's just jump right into the episode and see what we can do to remedy the whole situation um, and figure out what Catwoman's plan is because hopefully she's on our side by the end of all this. And again, thank you guys for the support. Feel free to like, subscribe anytime. All right, Fractured Mask. As the pressure to uncover the impending attack on Gotham intensifies, Bruce navigates his dual identity and his relationship with his new allies. Let's do this. I wear the mask in order to protect this city. But when faced with a new breed of criminals calling themselves the Pact, the direct approach was met with disaster. I had to don a different mask. As Bruce Wayne, I infiltrated their ranks. The plan was to get in, set the trap, and get out. But the plan failed. Now they're one step closer to their goal, and all I have are questions. What is the pact really after? Why steal Riddler's body? Friend or foe? I'm hoping friend. Nice place you got here. Did it come with the vermin? Or did you add that yourselves? This everyone? Riddler mentioned Harley. Miss Quinn is otherwise occupied. Our crossing the river stinks. We are the entirety of our cabal at the moment. Oh, this gentleman was someone we picked up after... Riddler's departure. Bruce Wayne. Bruce, was it? Charmed. Oh. Be gentle. This is Mr. Wayne's first foray into the field of felonry. Pleasure to meet you. Something tells me the pleasure is going to be all mine. Jesus. Enough pleasantries. You have the device. Excellent. Harley said your gems were in her safe. If she fails to return, you can pester John. He knows the code. It's fine. We can start. Oh. Oh, wait. Do you know the Riddler? What you staring at? Oh, let's get to... What are we doing? Well, we're going to... extricate the body. Uh... Riddler built a secret back door into the security system of his old employer. I need to scan his eyes and then create a retinal key for them. Then I'll use the key to make goggles, and we can open whatever doors he could. Oh. Help me lift. Yeah, sure. I mean, can we just, like, leave his body there and then just, you know, pop the eye open and check it out that way? Uh... This wasn't the original plan. He was supposed to be alive, but... Things change. So you were a part that of them for a long a good time. Position. Yeah, okay. I'm surprised. How long were you working with these guys, you know? That's far enough. Dig the plates under his lids. Press the button and scan away. Bro, where do people get the ideas for these devices? You know what I mean? Ugh, that's gross. Hmm. What the hell did they do to him? And what's with the refrigerator coffin? Why would the agency transport him like this? Maybe... This doesn't add up, Bruce. Hey, there's more to his body than we know. Bruce, I'm sorry about Lucius. I'm guessing it wasn't a gas leak or whatever the news said. Oh, uh, Riddler actually killed him too, so... You're right. Riddler killed him. But it was meant for me. Damn it, Bruce. I'm... This isn't all on you. Well, thank you for that. On to the next. Oh, we gotta get both eyes. Oh. 
That's just nasty, man. I didn't know what I'd be walking into with this group, but I certainly didn't expect it to involve you. And I know you're no stranger to peril, but you shouldn't be here. Well, I gotta figure out what they're doing. So, what gives? No one told me you would be joining us either. Can't say I'm surprised. Not everyone here is happy to see me. I knew Riddler before this. Hmm. He was the one who initially hired me. And he wound up dead, so... I'm not sure I have a lot of friends here. You're not the only one with questions. One question. Make it fast. Ooh, okay. Um, why are you here? Where have you been? Did you come back from me? Why How did here? you get involved with these psychopaths? Ran into Harley once or twice, but I knew Riddler. He tried to bring me in before... Well, before someone here probably killed him. Hmm, okay. <sighs> Have we concluded? Two eyes in the can. Excellent work. Then we can... Uh... <gasps> She's back! No! Are you serious? Oh, this is gonna be awesome. Oh! Sorry I'm late. Traffic was murder. Oh my god. <laughs> I couldn't stand it. You were there and, and I was here. I was on my way. Well, I was getting to get on my way. Look, I, I put on shoes. Oh, thanks, Puddin'. You would have had a blast if you were with me. Mm. Ooh. And how about this one? Did you miss me, sugar? Uh-oh. Oh, crap. Uh, John sure did. No, not really. Of course. Of course I did, Harley. You're... pure light. Oh. There's one thing I don't get, though. Maybe I'm sick. But if you missed me... Why the hell did you leave me behind? How? We were all in the truck, Since bro. Since Big Bad Bane's plan almost got one of our most valuable members killed today, we're having a change in management. Whoa, guys, not what right now. What the hell? So speak up if there are any objections. We can hash this out in a reasonable manner. Harley! Dang, dude. Okay. Bro smart. Bro is smart. Oh, this one's actually got some brain. He really does. <laughs> Everyone else better be smart too. Oh, uh, you <laughs> fine. Uh, uh, uh. You are a means to an end when this is over. Did it occur to any one of you people that the job we just pulled went sideways a little too quick? Uh oh. I think they knew we were coming because a little rat told them. Oh, crap. They was right to beat up his guy before we left to hit the convoy. He just beat up the wrong one. Since he couldn't deliver, I'm taking over the case. Oh, man, okay. And I'm not gonna let whoever it is stop me <laughs> from getting what I want. This leak, it almost got me killed. Yeah. So now, no one moves, no one breathes without my say-so. Oh, boy. Cause I'm gonna get to the bottom of this. And whoever it is, is gonna find their inside suddenly al fresco. That make you nervous, Bruce? No, not really. What do you have to say? Hey, I'm on your side, Harley. There's no need for threats. It's not way! Excuse me, peanut gallery. You got something to say? I got a guy? He pulled his own out there. Saw it with my own two eyes. And I ain't gonna let a good effort go unnoticed. What a Chad. Thank you. Then, let's get back to work. If anyone else has any issues with the New World Order, my door is always open. Hmm. <laughs> Lead us to our prize, and all will be forgiven. Yeah, Bane totally ditched on purpose, though. Wayne, come here a second. Cool. Thanks, bro. Thanks for vouching back there. Hey, it's tough in the trenches. Hey, we gotta look out for one another. Otherwise. Aw. Thanks, bro. No, I feel bad. <laughs> Hiya, Bruce. All right, Guess what's going you're on? Clear. 
Oh. For now. That's fair. Because apparently you're so capable. I got an errand for you. You're getting sweet on me. I know just about everything about Riddler's plan. But he kept one card close to his chest. The location of the job. Took the secret to his grave. Now I got his laptop. But look at this. And keep your yap shut. Can't let any of these mooks sense weakness. It's encrypted. Of course it is. It's like he knew not to trust any of us. <laughs> Go figure. <sighs> okay, let me see the laptop. I'm pretty tech savvy. Maybe I can crack Bruce, it. Bruce, in case you missed it, we have a mole problem. Oh. And until we clear that up, the keys to the kingdom stay with me. Got it? Yeah, that's fair. Riddler had a beef with his former employers, who are cooking up some very dangerous and super fun stuff at a black site lab somewhere here in Gotham. Oh. And what is it we're after, this super fun stuff? You ask a lot of questions. You know that? I was gonna say. Like, why would we be asking? I've been able to piece together most of his plan, except where the black site is. Hmm. You're gonna find the location. And when you do... Maybe you'll get a treat. A sweet, delicious little treat. You dodged my question. Okay, okay, hold on. I like. Nah. Okay, I'll help. Well, I'm your guy. What do you need? See, I ain't letting this laptop out of my sight until I clear up this mole problem. So, I want you to head over to Riddler's place and do some digging. Okay, sweet. I can do that. I might need some help. That place is full of death traps. Take John with you. Just don't get him hurt. That's my job. Road trip? With Bruce? I mean Actually, I was thinking Catwoman. Ah, oh, what? After all, she knew him. Mm, good points. Take it too. Okay, dang it. I'll grab some snacks. All right, bro. Grab some snackies. <laughs> What's that guy's story? Oh, come on. He's not hey, that bad. Are you more of a beef jerky or trumpet-shaped corn bites girl? Why am I even asking? I'll bring both. See, he's awesome. Well, there's never a dull moment with John around. Why do I get the feeling that's not a good thing? Oh, no, it's not that bad. Who's ready to hit the road? Haha, <laughs> my man. Who are you going to tell if you see anything that ain't on the up and up? You, Harley. But don't worry. Bruce is my best friend. He'd never betray me. Never, dude. Oh, sweet, innocent pudding. Friends have the easiest access to stab you in the back. Oh. Now get out of here. I call shotgun. Cool. I want that black site location. Yeah, no, 100%. Uh, she definitely knows, man. Man, he got his own flower and everything. This is awesome. Batman, the enemy within. Okay, this is looking good. I, okay, I don't know why Bruce was asking all those questions. If Harley was nervous about a mole why would she tell us anything right like that felt so weird i would have been quiet and just listened to what harley had to say Ooh, okay i can't believe this is where he decided to set up shop it wasn't like him to slum it i always thought the abandoned water tower was an odd choice I mean, the mole risk alone. It's not the abode of a man who asked me to steal a Renoir, that's for sure. Mm, we should check the traps. Who knows what Riddler did to this place? On it. Come on, John. Cool, cool, cool. All right, let's look around here. What? Really? Right now? Glad you answered. We need to talk. Listen about the convoy. We couldn't get to you safely. The EMP blast knocked out my ability to communicate with my field agents. Sorry. It obviously wasn't supposed to go down like that. Okay, look, thanks for the apology, thanks but the uh, apology. we gotta move. I'm trying my best here, Bruce. I hate to say it, but I underestimated just how ruthless and capable these freaks are. I gave you all the intel. You being inside. It's our best hope. So don't mess it up for me, then. Well, now they have Riddler's body. It was cryogenically frozen by the agency. Bruce, this was a 60-year-old man who went toe-to-toe -to -toe with Batman. I have some very interested researchers who wanted to see what kept him ticking. Okay, why are we doing this right now, wait, though? Wait, uh, I got the punchline wrong. 
Uh, let me start. It's fine, John. Riddler's eyes. They're a key to a door that lies somewhere in Gotham. And Harley doesn't know the location. Oh no, why are we saying this right now? I should have hung Stay up. Stay put for now and maintain your cover at all costs. This is our chance to get ahead of this train. So I say, Doc, I'll have what she's having. <laughs> <laughs> it was a good thing we searched around. I noticed an old security camera and deactivated it. Ooh, okay. No telling what will come across inside. Good work. Okay, let's find a way in. All right, and John, stick with me, please, man. You're too good for this world. Just have to get through these boards. Don't worry. I brought my key. Well, okay. Uh, <laughs> you're making too much noise, buddy. Love the enthusiasm. Okay. Look at him go. Let me give it a shot. Uh, okay, share and share alike is what I always say. Good man. There we go. It's not a bad attempt, but uh, we can't be too loud, buddy. I love the fact that I get to see Joker like this. This is cool. You are cool. All right, let's see what's going on here. Who's there? Don't move. Oh, I thought you guys checked the place. What were you guys doing? Oh no. Wait a minute. I know you. You're Bruce Wayne. Uh, guilty is charged. Oh, this looks bad. Want to explain what you're doing out here? Uh, planning on buying the place? This isn't exactly the heights. Uh, this isn't what it looks like. Uh, Gordon will vouch. You me. know I'm friends with Jim Gordon. If you want to check on me, just call him up. You think I'm going to interrupt the boss and his family at dinner? I don't know. Are you? Come on, boss. Uh, oh, oh, okay. Detective... Bullock. Detective oh. Bullock, correct. Uh, uh, look, there's actually a very good reason for all of this. Stay right there, jerkwad. I'm calling this in. Sure. I've been asked to report any suspicious activity around here, and you're acting suspicious. And that's totally fine. We can work this oh, come out. Come on, detective. We can work this out, just the two of us. I disagree. Ooh. Bruce freaking way. John. Unbelievable. Oh my I'd God. I'd be working tonight if I didn't need the extra dough. No, no, John, don't do anything. Wait, 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 hold on. Maybe this will make me look good with the boss. Uh. Oh, sure, sure. O overtime, right? Well, maybe, maybe I can help with that. I'm not that kind of cop. No, 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 no. Of course not. Of course not. This, this benefits both of us. Here, here. It's everything I got on me. Just hang up the phone, and it's yours. Come on, dude. Oh, thank God. So worried that John was gonna <laughs> wail on him. Try not to die in there. I do not want this coming back on me. I don't plan to. Well, what was that? Come on, let's get moving. You shouldn't be... Okay, see, that. this changes the whole scene at the bar. He definitely knew what he was doing. I feel like he did it with Riddler. He was so comfortable ready to knock the guy out with a crowbar. Oh, my God. Okay, let's see. Unexpected encounter. It was a very good one. Okay, let's see. I really wish you at least got me some glasses. Oh, I'm back at this place again. Uh, it's even worse than I expected. Yep. The man I knew was flawed, but he could still muster a little warmth. Warmth? Uh, sounds like you knew a very different Riddler than the one I met. We met. <laughs> I wish he'd never come back to Gotham. Oh. Me too. Oh, come on, guys. Like... No one's beyond reach, John. There's hope for everyone. I don't think any of us are beyond reach. <laughs> I know we've just met, but somehow I knew you'd say that. <laughs> what? Oh! <laughs> Rosary in the room. You knew him best. Where do you think he'd keep any info on what we're after? Well, not to state the obvious, but... It's probably behind a riddle or a puzzle somewhere. Oh, I call the downstairs bedroom. <laughs> oh, careful, John. This place is probably a death trap. Follow him, Bruce. I don't want John's curiosity to get us killed. That's totally fair. Honestly, there's definitely more to John, though. I'm really tempted to touch something. <laughs> Just be careful when you do, bro. 
Bro, I love this. I really love the fact that we got John here helping us out. All right, let's examine here. There's a hand cart from last hand time. Hand cart? I wonder what he was moving. I mean, look, we, we can see the actual cell right there. I think that's what he was moving. How you doing, buddy? Hey, Bruce, I've been wanting to talk to you. Go for it. Alone. Oh. You have? I don't like how cozy Catwoman was with Riddler. Oh. Because he was a killer? Because he was rude to me. Oh. <laughs> we need to stick together. I don't trust this kitten one bit. Oh. You know what they say about a black cat crossing your path. It's okay. No, she's nice once you get to know her. Right, let's agree to disagree. But I'll keep my peepers peeled for both of us. Thanks, buddy. Of course. She's not that bad, trust me. Oh, okay. He definitely... I love how they wrote him. It's like he knows everything but acts like the fool. You know what I mean? Okay, let's see here. Let's look around the workbench. This is where he built his boxes. <sighs> okay, well, I was... Oh, floorboard. Examine. That's odd. Yep, let's move it aside. How did we not see that the first time we were here? Okay, wait. Uh, before we go touch pressure plates... Okay, let's look around first before we go touching a pressure plate. We know about the death chamber. We know about all this. Actually, maybe we can talk to Catwoman during this time. Okay, let's see here. We checked all the news articles and the beds and everything. How you holding up? Hey, Catwoman. Hey, money man. <laughs> money man. I love that. Oh, wait. Do you ever think about me? Oh, yeah. How'd you, how'd you and the Riddler How'd you meet? and Riddler first meet? You know, I do a lot of freelance work. Let me guess. Riddler wanted a painting from the Louvre. Without bragging too much, it was an easy job. Huh. After all, I'd already robbed the place twice. Oh. He became a valuable contact when money was tight. Interesting. Okay, wait. Did you ever... Okay, wait. Did you ever think about me? I'm just curious if you... Yes? If you missed me. Aw. John is right downstairs. Yes or no? Answer the question. Fine. Of course I did. Aw, okay, that's sweet. But don't read any more into it than that. Oh, yeah, you know, yeah, because we got to focus, because you know the mission, okay? You know, I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm focusing, 100%. I'm clean. I'm clear. And undercover, okay? So why are you really here? I said I'd tell you when we're alone. We're not. Okay, that's I'll tell fair. you later. No problem. You're right. God, why did I even ask that? <laughs> All right, let's move. Let's see here. Ooh, a pair of shoes. You're... You're taking his shoes? They might be useful. Okay. They're less expensive than what you usually wear. Dang, bro. I like the style, okay? They got... They got... Wait. Move aside. Are you serious? Oh, there's another one. Bro, how did we miss this when we were first here with Gordy? Riddler's bed couldn't look less comfortable if he tried. I have a single bed like that, but uh, no, no thank you. Hey, he's got fruit bars. Canned food, and lots of it. We can't all get lobster thermidor on a whim. That's true. But personal. <laughs> it's not like I do anyway. I don't even have time to eat half of that stuff. Oh, okay, we're just looking at it, okay. All right, then let's see. That means there's two pressure plates. One up here, one downstairs. Then that means we probably have another one here. I got to move the carpet then. The Riddler, like, insignia here. Can we move that? Okay, no. Maybe if we examine this pressure plate. Okay, yeah, no. I was hoping that we'd have, like, a unique animation with that one. Maybe there's another one around here. John, you found anything? I love that smile, bro. Your hair is really green. Oh, why'd you hate the Riddler? You seem to love Harley. John, we're friends, right? So I gotta ask, what do you see in Harley? A ruthlessness. Oh. The way her accent comes and goes when she's mad. The way she lets things escalate into violence. <laughs> oh, uh, your hair is really green. I I've been meaning to ask it. The green hair, what, what is, what is that? I don't know, what's with your black hair? 
<laughs> sorry. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm a little sensitive about my style. You got the drip. Hey, you don't worry. Didn't mean to make you uncomfortable. I don't remember anything about myself before Arkham, and when I came to, well, here it was. Oh. I guess it's natural. Just like your charming personality, my dude. Never change. Why do you hate Riddler so much? I've mentioned this before, but uh, he always interrupted me. Never let me get to the punchline. It takes a lot of confidence to tell a joke, you know? Made me look like an idiot in front of Harley and those other guys. Hmm. Well, hey, uh, I guess I have the last laugh now. Bro. <laughs> I don't know. Like, I'm glad, but dude, I swear, I think John actually did KO the Riddler at this point. Like, no, and every I don't know what you're referring to as punchline. I don't know. With with Joker, I'm always second guessing, man. I, I'm, I'm, just, I'm I'm not I'm not even thinking straight. Here, let's see here. So we moved that plate. There's probably one around here somewhere. How many TVs does one guy need? Probably afraid he'd miss something. That's fair. Let's see here then, let's look around. Uh, we've already examined all this stuff here, so if it's not gonna be on the floorboards here, what about the chamber? You gotta admire the ingenuity. It's a wonderful toy. It's a wonderful way to lose your hand. Yep. Well, you know what they say. Curiosity killed the cat. There's Jeez. something under here. What? Some kind of platform. Dude, okay, this is like... So now I gotta use... I, I can move the death chamber. <laughs> this is all Let too convenient. Oops. Yeah, sure. I don't want you to bend your cover bow. Sure, no problem, dude. Just be careful when you're pushing it on me, okay? Nice. Oh! Um. Deeper and deeper you go. This is the vortex of life, pulling you down into its depths. How did the agency not find any of this? Of course. <laughs> you work, you sleep, you die. At all times, one foot in the grave until the second inevitably follows. You have to work hard and sleep hard in order to earn your way six feet under. What did I tell you? What? I suppose those are our clues to whatever Riddler is hiding in here. I mean, well, we better repeat that. Hold on. Can we, yeah, I want to hear what he says again. Can you repeat that again? That's pretty important. Yeah, okay, I'll explore, but I need to know what he was saying. Work, sleep, death. A little grim. A oh. little boring is what it is. Work. Well, hey, look, no, 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 hold on. So work was the platform here. Hold on, hold on. Whoa, I gotta be careful. I'm not gonna touch the arc reactor, come on. Tesla coils. This whole place is an electrical death cage. Exactly. If these start sending out energy, we'll all fry. I know, not really a nice guy. Wait, do we actually have the option to touch it though? I'm sorry. I intrusive intrusive thoughts one. <laughs> I'm sorry. I had to do that. Intrusive thoughts for the win. Okay, we already know work, sleep. So let's go with stand on. Place the shoes for the work part. Nice. This is my city. Oh, this is my plan. Nobody will interfere. <sighs> That sounds positive. Right. Okay, wait, so that means we gotta find other things as well because for sleep is the next one. Oh, I have, I still have one of Riddler's shoes. Okay, so let's see. Yeah, let's go check out the um, place shoe. Stand on it for a second, I just wanna see. Ah, ah, ah. Oh. To truly understand my mind, you must first walk a mile in my... 
Certainly, you know the rest. Oh, I, okay. I'm worried we're running out of time here. Yeah, no worries. We're fine. We're fine, dude. Don't even worry about it. I got it. I got it. Place the shoe. You're really something, Riddler. I take you by night. By day, take you back. None suffer to have me, but do from my lack. <laughs> okay. Well, then the last one, I don't see any other possible items we could use. Uh, let me just think, though. If there's no other possible items, let's see. I don't. I think we're supposed to stand on, stand on it now. Unless, yeah, because I don't see any other items. I guess we'll have to stand on it. Let's stand on it. Oh, goody. It looks like you've got both feet in the grave. Oh! How does no one that? find this? It's like you're standing on an elevator. I bet whatever we're looking for is down there. Probably. Maybe someone should stay up here. Keep watch. Good point. Let's go, Bruce. Sorry, cat lady. Oh. Or maybe you could stay? Yeah, Hold buddy. Up. Harley gave me an assignment, and I mean to fulfill it. Oh. Uh, we'll make sure it's safe. Listen. Oh, okay. Give us some. Oh, I like that. Give us a moment. Uh, John, could you give us a moment? Uh, oh. <laughs> yeah, gotcha. Thanks, buddy. Uh, I'm sorry. It worked, though. I Don't complain, Catwoman. Come on. Thanks, John. <laughs> He's something. Charming and unnerving at the same time. But he means well. So, now that we have a moment, care to fill me in? Care to tell me the real reason you're doing this? <laughs> Out with it, Bruce. What's going on? I switched your life for time under car. It kind of seemed fun. <laughs> oh, I don't know. It seemed like fun. Stepping outside your comfort zone and all that. Changing it up can be healthy. Maybe there's room for us to finally meet in the middle. <laughs> Sorry if I was a little rattled at the clubhouse back there. No, you're fine. Wasn't quite ready to see your face again, but you look good. Even with what looks like a piercing gone wrong. Not great or anything. Aw, well, you look great you too. You look great too. I didn't say great, I said good. Okay, duly noted. Okay. Now it's my turn. Why are you here? You're not really in bed with this pact. And what if I am? Maybe oh. I need the money. Maybe I don't. Who knows? The world's a complicated place. Well, then we're in well, this looks like we're both in this together. As criminals. I guess so. I guess that's the absolute truth of this moment. Yoo-hoo! Can you two get a move on? Playing guard is getting pretty boring. Just another minute. We've got it under control, John. Fine. But we've got a job to do, remember? I know, but you gotta wait. Let's wing just see me, what this is all about. <laughs> okay, let's see. And if anything, I know you've met the Riddler, but you haven't met the Rizzler. Boom! <laughs> I'm good. I'm done. Okay. <laughs> Turn on the computer. Let's examine everything first. We need to figure it out before we uh, go start touching things. This might hold the black side location. Exactly. Let's see here. Okay, let's examine the room first. Oh, the cane. Didn't Riddler carry one of these in Europe? He did, but they were purely aesthetic. Oh, okay. All right, let's see then. We already know about the ports. Is there anything else in the room? Finally, cabinets. Yeah, I think it might be a trap. Maybe, but we already made it past the line of security, so maybe not. No, you can never Your think safe with Riddler. Assuring. Yeah, I was gonna say. You should, you should never think safely with Riddler. He's just a maniac, right? So he'll probably have a backup on a backup. Oh, not a typical on button. Wait, what? <sighs> Encrypted. Uh. Just like the laptop. There must be something nearby we can use. Okay. Then let's see. It's, I mean, the cane is the only thing I can visibly see that might be it. Keyboard, USB ports. Oh, there's a drive. USB drive. Should we go use it though? 
That'd be so weird if he had the decryption stuff on that USB. It'd be weird. Okay, let's see. Eh. Here we go. No pain, no gain. Decryptor detected. Accessing Sanctus Project Lotus files. Are you serious? Okay. Project Lotus. Sanctus. Retinal scan required. Ah, good thing we have it. Shit. I haven't made the goggles yet. Oh, what? Can't we like use it Retinal now? Or? scan. Time out. The fastest protocol detected. Oh no, you're the serious. Decryptor. Grab it! Grab it! Grab it! Wait! Jesus. You know what Sanctus is, don't you? I heard stories on jobs. Best I can piece together, their group up to no good is generous. They're scary. Oh. Great. One thing's for sure. We're not getting any more info off that thing. Okay, that's fair. Well, there's always Riddler's laptop. Harley still has it. The decryptor probably works with that as well. Everything okay down there? Send the lift back up. I should have come back sooner and reeled Riddler in, but I didn't. Knowing he was tangled up with Sanctus, and what he did to Lucius. Okay, hold on. This is my fault. Nope. My mess to clean up. That's not By how yourself? that works. I can help. Yeah. Why? Do I look like I need your help? You don't have the code to do what needs to be done here, Bruce. You want to do this your way? You'll have to beat me to it. Oh, come on. I thought we are supposed to work together. <laughs> I still fall for these traps somehow. Boink! Whoa! What are you doing? Balancing the scales. You are not leaving here with that. Oh, uh, come honey. on. I'm already gone. Are you serious? All right. <laughs> Gotta chair it. Ah. Cherish this moment. John, back me up! Resourceful as always. I never stopped. Oh! There it is! Gems are not in the locker. Nope! Oh. I skipped leg day. Bye, Bruce. It's been fun. Oh, just cut! Give me that cane! Yep! Bam! Let's go, go, Riddler grappling hook. Wow, that thing's pretty OP. Grab her. <laughs> Not today, cat. Oh, you've gotten rusty. You haven't gotten past me yet. Oh, the fight's just getting started. Bam. Slow down a bit. You're coming out blurry. There we go. Oh. Just give the USB, dude. Oh. Oh, jeez. I forgot how skilled you are with your hands. We can figure the rest out later. <laughs> oh, whatever. Go for it. I'm going in. <laughs> Damn it! I fell for it again! Curse my Rizzler. Oh. <laughs> Awfully bold move considering we just met, Mr. Wayne. This is flirting. It is, John. Move, it is. John. No! Ah, oh, damn it. I had to give it a shot. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, are you serious? She is not getting away. Sweep the legs. Sweep it. Get one of these. Whoop. Oh, no, you don't. Yikes. Whoop. Oh, crap. Oh, my legs. <laughs> Having fun, John. Why? Sorry, Bruce, but I'm taking Harley's laptop for myself. Uh oh. And I'm finishing this my way. Ah, <clears throat> oh, so reckless. <clears throat> Harley's laptop, huh? You and I were going to talk. Oh crap. Somewhere else. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Oh, it's over. All right, man. It's just you and me. What you got? What? Oh, that's the stuff. Why did I get one? No, hey, give me his, give me what he's got. I don't want so, tea. So, John, about the laptop. Um, you know, I'm the first guy who resort to stealing from anyone, anyone but her. 
But in a way, that almost makes it more enticing. But in another way, maybe I tell her, getting her good graces. Oh, man. Maybe I will. Maybe I'll do just that. Then she remember my name has an H in it. Oh, come she on. She spells it J-O-N. We're friends. Because we're friends, John. This is between us. Oh, we are friends. We are. But Harley's... Harley? <laughs> I don't know, Bruce. I'm torn here. <sighs> I don't want to... Just thinking about her makes me feel like I'm floating. I can imagine, She's buddy. She's the most intriguing creature ever to grace me with a demeaning insult. Which is great. Don't, don't get me wrong. I, I, I want more, Bruce. Like you and Catwoman. Oh. I'm only a little ashamed to say that dance had my pulse pounding. What's your relationship with her? Your real one. Um, you know what? Yeah, you know what? Why not? Let's be honest with him. I guess you could say she's my Harley. I'm not sure she's good for me, but I just can't seem to get away from her. You stop right there, Bruce Wayne. I'm tearing up. <laughs> Look at this couple of weeping willies over here. Drowning our sorrows in caffeine and sugar. <sighs> if only Harley saw me. Like, really saw me. The world's a crazy place, isn't it? I want Harley, and you want the laptop. Maybe we can come to an arrangement. I help you with Harley. <laughs> I see. You're up to bat, then, Wayne. I love this what interaction. What can you do to make Catwoman purr? How can I get that with Harley? Oh, my boy. Okay. You wanna, you wanna know how to be the Rizzler? I got you. How can I make her see me? You know, uh, yeah, I want. No, you don't pull her strings. You gotta be yourself, bro. One to one with her. I mean, she's kind of whack, but your whackness will work with her whackness. So yeah, just be yourself, John. You just need to be genuine. You're special, John. She just needs to see that. So, be myself. Yeah. I hear that a lot, but how can I be myself if? don't really know who that is yet. How did you know who you are, Bruce? Hmm. Actually, don't. I've always known. I'm different every day. I've always known. I've always known who I am. Something happened early on that... that made me what I am today. Oh, I hope a moment like that finds me soon. It will, buddy. It must be great to be... who you're supposed to be. Well, hey. Whoa, hey, that stare, hey. I can feel someone a few layers deep, pacing like an animal in a cage, just looking for something to start it. Oh. The prison break. Oh. No, maybe stick with being nice until you figure it out. Yeah. People appreciate kindness, even Harley. Probably. How does that even work? Bond with her. Lend a hand with a problem she has. I don't know, Bruce. I have a tough time just talking to her. Oh, I've got an idea. Let's play pretend. Uh, what? Uh, what? You'll be Harley. Uh, okay. Say something Harley would say. Uh, Bane is a loser. This is ridiculous. This laptop is all mine. Bane is such a loser. Oh, yeah? What are you gonna do to him? Oh. Snuff out his light. I don't know what she would say. <laughs> yeah, I'd kill for some front row seats to that. Okay. Okay. Now say something, uh, date-like. Okay, okay, John. We're out painting the town red. Bro. Hi, John. I like hiking. Do you like the outdoors? Boys, you love me! Uh. Give a, hey, give him time. We'll fix that. We'll fix that. So, so what do you think? John, Pretty good, right? Uh, we need we need to practice. Uh, stay on topic. Too desperate. Okay, so you're coming off just a little bit desperate. And women like that? No, no, none. None, no, bro. Okay, hit me. Another. Okay. What was your favorite thing about Arkham Puddin'? For me, it was Sloppy Joe Fridays. 
Bruce! This is just uncanny. <laughs> okay, okay. Here we go. I enjoyed the lights. They had a hum to them. Felt like a blanket. Fuzzy, even. I miss that on the outside. It, it doesn't feel as real here, you know? Out here, chaos seems to rule the day. It's loud and uneven. But you, Harley, you thrive on it. I could learn from that because I thrive on you. You're my light outside of Arkham. Oh my god. Bro, whoa, whoa, hey. Okay, no, that, that was awesome. It's beautiful, John. She'll be eating out of your hand in no time. Y you think? I, I don't know. It, it felt weird no, to say. No, dude, that was raw. Go for I that. I really think I'm getting the hang of this. I'll start the next one. Yeah, no. Your face has all the adequate face-like qualities one looks for in uh, in a face. Uh-oh. Harley, I lobbed you a perfect pitch. You gonna swing or what? Ooh, John, um, sorry, something just came up. Yeah. Uh, it's business. I have to run. So soon? I'm sorry, it's buddy. It's fine. A for effort, Bruce. It's okay. I guess I won't go tattling to Harley. Well, thanks, man. So, will you help me get the laptop? Gosh, Bruce. Oh, we God. are friends, and you're right about that. And, uh... Teamwork talk makes the dream work. Really got me fired up to find myself. Good guy. There we go. My true self. Okay. Plus, your Harley is spot on. Thanks, man. <laughs> Drive a hard bargain, mister. Wait. Jeez. <laughs> okay. Let me mull over the logistics. But I'm in. Nice. Okay, cool. Meet me back at the subway when you're done with your business. Yeah. And because we're pals, coffee's on my dime. Nice. Oh, come Bruce? on. No. What? Why would you leave? Hey, don't do that to him. Just remember, John, just like your punchlines, you needed time to figure out the joke, right? Establish the joke, then go for the punchline. That's your job with Harley. Okay, I'm disappearing now. Goodbye. <laughs> I would have at least said that. I hate how we just ditched him on the table like that. He was, that was really deep and pretty dark at the same time, but it was cool, you know? All right, sorry for taking a bit, Gordy. Jim? Good evening. Oh, it's good you're here. The last time I fired this up, you didn't show. Had me concerned. I'm still recovering. What do you mean? The agency convoy? All those freaks were in one place, and you decide not to show? No, I didn't like you. You don't take time off. I stayed in the shadows. So what kept you? Waller called me. Waller up. ordered me to stand down. You're kidding. <sighs> the nerve on her. Oh, no, I shouldn't have done that. Uh, I guess I can't really talk. We got there late. Uh, by then it was just Quinn. She still hospitalized a dozen good cops, then gave us a slip. Is that all? Uh, no. No, I... Uh, I got a favor to ask. Oh, sure. Lucius Fox. Yeah. I know he was your friend, and I don't mean to speak ill of the dead. But I think he might have been up to some shady stuff before Riddler's attack on Wayne Tower. He might not have been the man you thought. Oh, okay, wait, um... Not entirely. It, Lucius Fox was a saint. I knew Lucius Fox for years, Gordon. The man was a saint. Yeah. On the surface, maybe. There's more to the story. Riddler targeted him for a reason. Ah, this sucks. I Waller wish I could shut tell him. down any investigation into the circumstances surrounding his death. And that means something stinks in Denmark. Yep. They could follow that stench all the way to Fox's employer. Oh. Look, just how much do you really know about Bruce Wayne? Ah, oh, crap. I can't tell him, but... <sighs> Only what's public. Bruce is helping you. Bruce is helping you. I see where you're going with this, but you're on the wrong trail. Bruce Wayne is helping you. Uh, well, if he's helping us, he has a real funny way of doing it. Meets the money, gets to your head. At first, I thought Fox was at the center of it all. 
But there's a hell of a lot more. A Wayne Enterprises security guard comes to GCPD saying he was assaulted by Harley Quinn and her gang. And who was leading her around like a pet? Bruce Wayne. Mm. Then I checked the video recordings. Someone did an amateur job covering up the security footage. Files were replaced, time unaccounted for, sloppy. Oh no, Alfred. He's too stressed. And strike three? He flashes enough cash at one of my officers to get into Riddler's old workshop. Oh, dang. Why? Wayne even dropped my name with Bullock, like I'd back him up. Oh no. <laughs> Dirtbag's got stones, I'll give him that. Bruce Wayne is dirty, and he's dangerous. Waller knows all of this happened, too, and she refuses to let me move on it. So I need you to bring him in. <sighs> That's the favor. Ah, oh, buddy, okay. I can't do it. But you can. Keep an eye on him. Dang it! I can keep an eye on Bruce Wayne. Damn it, I'm not asking for an eye. I want him delivered. Here, with a little bow. I wish I could take off the mask right now God, to show him. Safety is slipping out from under me and I can't stand it. I know your friend Catwoman's in town. Got a rap sheet that'll put her away for life. Maybe I can't move on Bruce Wayne, but I can move on her. What? Are you serious, bro? I should have done this a year ago. Seriously, Jim. <laughs> bro, just do what you have I to. I can't ask you to break the law, Jim. As soon as I get back to the office, I'm sending out a task force after her. <laughs> and you. You better not tell her we're coming. Damn, bro. He sounds like he's on a warpath. Yeah. If I warn Selena and she gets away, Gordon and the police will blame me. But if I don't, I put her in danger. Don't forget that you're both after that laptop. Gordon might be your best chance to slow her down. Unfortunately, we're running out of time. No, dude. Waller was not right to demote him, and he's not out of line. He's stressed, man. It's my fault yeah. Gordon is like this. I want to tell him everything, but I can't. You can! Secrets poison relationships, Bruce. I know! But to protect this city, to protect yourself, he can't know. I don't care about myself. I care about the city, you damn know, it. Miss Kyle is going to run sooner or later. It's her nature. How much can you really trust her as an ally? But, uh... I know how you feel about her. Make certain you aren't letting that cloud your judgment. I trust her, Al. But can you trust her to do the right thing? You know what must be done. Oh my god, are you serious? GC, oh my god. Send the message or don't send the message? Oh crap, okay. Ah, okay. I know Gordy's gonna hate me if I do it, but uh, but I do, like, if I get the laptop, then I can secure the details before she messes it all up. Oh, but... I can't... I just don't like... <sighs> Send the message. Screw it. It's done, Al. I hope Gordon doesn't take it personally. I'm afraid he will. Yep, and it's on me. Don't go, Gordon. What? I've got a city to say. <laughs> How did you get up here? Please, Jim. You have to let me in. John? I can't do that, man. It's too much. I love this. I'm John. I'm the best friend you have in spandex or whatever my suit is. I'm just curious about how far he goes. You can trust me. It's, it's my mustache. Your mustache? Waller ordered me to shave it. Gas, how dare she? It's a symbol of justice, like the little hammers judges use. You think I don't know that, the Batman? Bro, this is actually kind of awesome. I've had it since I was a baby. Okay, I need to see how far this goes. I can help, Jim. I have sharp batarangs. No, this is my burden to bear. I need one final night my best facial feature, alone. <laughs> I want to feel it rustle in the breeze that comes off the bay. Maybe get pizza cheese stuck in it for one last time. Okay, that was awesome. Jim, That's... I'm, I'm sorry. What if I grew a mustache <laughs> for you? Batman, <laughs> hi, hello. So, uh, John, my name's John. John Doe. 
You don't know me. Well, we actually did cross paths once, but, uh... What did you overhear? I, I didn't hear anything. I just got here, I swear. No, no, no. Oh, this is just... What a pleasure. So nice to finally meet you. Oh. It's just a handshake. Oh yeah, come on, shake his hand. Nice to meet you, John. Wow, quite a grip you've got there. You must squeeze a stress ball a lot. I've been waiting over a year for that moment. Aw. I'm just such a huge fan of yours. And here you are, in the flesh. Bro, this is wholesome. <laughs> and weird at the same time. I'm looking for mentors, role models. Oh. I've come across a few good candidates. You're, you're Batman. <laughs> I don't take on students. Yeah, sorry, buddy. Now, hold on. Before you accept, here's what I bring to the table. I can get you Riddler's laptop. What? All his secrets right there. And the gang who attacked the convoy, they needed to pull off a big score. The point. So what if I steal it from Harley Quinn, no less, and give it to you? What? But, uh, and, and, this, is, and this is a big but. I need you to promise nothing bad will happen to Harley. Oh no, dude. Oh no. I mean, letting one criminal slip through the cracks every once in a while can't be the worst. No, no, I, I... That depends on what she does. I'm sorry, John. If she hurts innocents, then I stop her. Well, that's... You really... This is what dedication looks like, huh? Yep. Well, if I get the laptop, uh, there is no score, so win-win. Okay. Oh, whoa, careful. Now, now, when you're on the job, what's the preferred method of extracting a target? Always repelling in, or explosives as a distraction, or... You know what? I'll wing it. Okay. If I were you, I'd get a friend to help. 100%. That's a great idea. I hope Bruce is there. He'd do anything for me. Oh, one last thing. Oh. <laughs> uh, you know what? Go for it. <laughs> I collect these. They mean a lot to me. I want to destroy the phone, but I'll let him keep it. Come on. Oh, we look so cool. I mean, you're cool. Uh, I'm, not, I'm not usually cool, but next to you, I look cool. You're pretty damn cool, dude. Come on. This is going to look great on my wall. Thank you. Laptop behind the stack deck. I'll be there. Promise. Hope to die. He knows. He has to know. There's no way he doesn't know that we're Batman. We just quoted saying, go to the stack deck. He won't be disappointed. <laughs> and then he conveniently shows up here. Yeah, he has to know, dude. I'm... Okay, Telltale, you did fantastic with Joker on this one. I love John. You speak. Oh. All I hear are lies. You dishonor yourself, Timothy. If you are the rat, then wear it proud. Oh, no. I would have respect for that. And with respect comes mercy. Greetings, Wayne. Mm. Come with me. Oh, sure. As a fellow apostle of technology, I thought you might appreciate this. Okay, let's see. Bane and I were acquiring components for a device I'll need once we get to the black site. Device? Yes, an ice explosive for the fire failsafe we anticipate encountering. That isn't the impressive detail. Ooh, what else you got? As we ran into interference, I determined I would be more efficient if I made smaller versions and employed them as projectiles. Who were they? Whoa. Hindrances. No, no, don't lose your cool. As you can see, it's been wildly successful. Yeah, no, no, we Perhaps can't. Perhaps Wayne Enterprises could benefit from my efforts. Impressive science freeze. You'll notice I don't do anything ineffectually, Mr. Wayne. Yeah. Hear that, Freeze? Wayne, he's cut out for this life after all, huh? <laughs> See, we gotta be careful. Huh. I never would have guessed after he shied away from beating the last man I suspected. One more time, my friend. Oh, no. Why did an alarm go off when it was your job to ensure it didn't? Bane, come on. I, I slipped up. Dangerous time to make a mistake when you knew I was looking for a mole. You're trying to slow us down! Oh, no! Look, I want to get paid just like you! 
I got mouths to feed. Then, when the police arrived, you were nowhere to be found. I... I gotta back him up. Yeah, come on. You know I'm no traitor. 100%. I stood up for you. Remember? I really do, yeah. Come on, man. We have to stand together on this. Yeah, you're brave. Yeah, man. sure. Pretty bold move. Good, yeah, yeah. Now, now why, why would I do that if I was dirty? I'd have thrown you to the walls to cover my ass, right? Oh, 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 a deft turn. But it's not enough to save you. Oh, you're kidding me. In fact, your awareness of how to deceive only creates more suspicion. Oh, no. What the hell is going no, on no, here? No, 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 no. No, we're just... Oh! Merely plugging the leak. Uh. God damn it, Bane. You running your own investigation? I gotta check on him. Come on, dude. I'm sorry, bro. Dude, that's hey, not hey, fair. Hey. Hold on. Damn it. Jesus, man. Come on. Oh, no. Why are you complaining? I didn't get a chance to grill the guy. I'm a trained psychiatrist. What are you? A side of beef with a hunch. Hey. I'll find the rat, and I'll deal with it. Hmm. You can't be trusted to run your men anymore. They're mine now. Got Yours? It. <laughs> I freed them from Santa Prisca. You Dang. just killed one. I only shot him. Oh my god. Who do you think wins that recruitment war? They won't follow you. What do you want, John? Right. The laptop. This seems like the perfect time. Oh. You don't know for sure it was him. So now what? They know the cost. I value loyalty above all else. You know who's gonna have a tough time being loyal now? That guy. That's fair. Just keep her busy. I have to sneak into her office to get it. Okay. And, uh, it's all yours. Okay. Yep. Getting it for my old buddy Bruce. And only you. Promise. Sound like a plan. Okay, just be careful. Up top. All right, come on. High five him. Yes, that was a good one. Hey, you two. What's going on with you guys? Harley, we're just brown out. What a surprise. You guys get me a black site location or not? Ooh. The answer had better be yes, Harley. We didn't find the location to the black site yet, but we did uncover the code name for whatever you're after. Project Lotus, ring any bells? Yep. And what is Project Lotus? What do you want? Shouldn't you be informing your men they work for me now? You? You can't even keep these two from colluding. Excuse me? <laughs> Are you kidding me? He's loyal to a fault. Yeah, look at my I'm guy. Loyal, Harley. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Because I want to be. Because I'm being myself. The mole, Bane's men, you maybe, possibly, potentially can't handle it alone. Huh? <laughs> you have a problem, and I want to help. Oh, come on. You, time out. Ah, oh, crap. I'm so sorry, John. And you, we need to talk. All right, let's go upstairs now. Great. Ah, oh, dang it, that sucks. <laughs> Bruce, Bruce, Bruce. Got some juice? Nope, the noose. This here's one of my favorite toys. Helps me make boring things into pretty things. I don't really need makeup, though. I'm good. Can you be a smart guy and guess another one of my favorite toys? Uh, hammer? Come on. You can do it. You mean your hammer? <laughs> Good guess. But no. It's John. Oh. You two are getting a little too close for comfort. Hey, are you jealous? So I'm making a new rule. Oop. Hands off. There is no hands. Not Honest, even on. John's mine. And mine alone. Oh no. So don't play with my toys. 
Or I'll bash in that pretty face of yours. I didn't even plan to. John's a bro. God, no, not right now. <sighs> really Alfred, get a that. suit ready for drop off. Of course. Was your accomplice successful? Apparently not. Dang it! What happened? Catwoman got here first. Oh, that sucks! So wait, if I sent Gordon after her or didn't warn her, then we would have gotten the laptop. Ah, uh, bro. Ah, oh, there she is. Seriously, I thought we were on the same side, dude. Hey, I was hoping you'd catch up to me. Right. I hadn't had a chance to thank you for tipping me off about the GCPD. I didn't expect it. You really saved my ass. If it wasn't for you, the cops would have gotten the drop on me for sure. Look, I'm glad I could help it still. Glad I could be of help. Well, let's just say that I owe you one. So give me the laptop. Good. Because I need a favor. The laptop. I need you to hand it over. You proved your point. Quite the coincidence that we find ourselves here again. What do you mean again? We're on top of the mayor's old office. Harvey's old office. Oh. Feels like a hundred years ago, doesn't it? Since we had our first chase. So much has happened since then. Yeah, it does. That's the night I saved your life. First time I saw you. We had something then. Same as we do now. A give and a take. <laughs> you want it? Yes! Take it. Oh, come on. <laughs> you didn't think it'd be that easy, did you? Okay, you really like fighting too much. This is gonna be a problem when we're- Oh, and get to the vent. To the helipad. Bam, bam. Boink! See, I learned from my mistakes. Oh, you gotta be- Okay, I thought she chucked it off the roof. Oh. Dude, how does she- Flip and do stuff like that. You have a lot of faith in that helicopter. Oh. I'm going for it. Yoink. Nice. Go, go, grappling hook. See? Perfect. Thanks. I needed that. Oh, come on. That was fun. I bring out that wild side of yours. The one you like to keep stuffed down in that suit. The side of you that's just aching to break free. Yeah, it's a little crazy. Yes. But isn't that what you like about me? I like you when you're sane. We both like to live on the edge. It's okay. where we find each other. Loco Coco. Maybe it is. Maybe you're just my kind of crazy. And maybe you're mine. That actually works. <laughs> well, have a good night. Of course. Selena. Why'd you do it? Run off at Riddler's like that. Yeah, I know. I wanted to get payback for Riddler. On my own terms. Seriously? For what they did to him. For what he did to you. Uh, that makes no sense. I'm not gonna lie. And just, what are you offering me in return? You're a man of many resources. Make me an offer I can't refuse. Taco Bell. Okay, Selena. <laughs> I'll give you what you want. And what is it you think I want? Something meaningful. With someone who has your back. You had your chance. But I'm a gambling girl. Maybe you'll get another. Oh, okay. <laughs> Just promise to work with me. I'll stop playing games. Please, yes. In the past, there was a chance for something more between us. You missed it. Well, you were with Dent. I and mean... it seemed like, for a moment at least, you wanted more than that. I came back to stop Harley's so-called pact. The Eddie I knew would have wanted that. Oh. Anything else? Us? That's just icing on the cake. No pressure. 
Really? Strictly for just go for it, dude. No, we're going for it. I don't even care. All right, there we go. Now, if Gordon doesn't show up on the roof, just take the USB, please. Wait, steal the decrypt. Steal the decrypt. Nah, just go for it. <laughs> just keep going. I trust that you'd actually give that, please. <laughs> Thank you. See, look, better. So, I'd say it's time to find a black site, partner. We'll probably need our own supercomputer to get into his laptop. But something tells me you might know where to find one. Oh, invite to the back cave? Yeah, join us. Just help us decrypt it. Come home with me. Oh. <laughs> Wait! What's at home? You'll see. I thought we were gonna decrypt. Hey! Whoa, hold on. Bruce went two miles ahead of me. I originally thought we were just gonna invite her to the bat cave to decrypt everything. All right, that, that works. Hmm. And you definitely have to say hi to Alfred. He's been through a lot. I'm not gonna lie. I thought I'd seen it all when I found you hanging with the sewer rats, Bruce. This place. It's really you. Rich men and their toys. Only thing missing is a wet bar. Mm. Make yourself comfortable. I'll try. This place, it's not exactly cozy. I, mean, I know the job how done. hard it is to let people in. The fact that you've done that it means a lot to me, Bruce. I didn't give a damn about anyone else until I met you. Hmm. You're a you bad influence that? on me. Aw, you mean it? Do you really mean <laughs> that? Don't let it go to your head. Too late! It's already in the vault. Being here with you. I came back to Gotham for a little redemption, but I didn't expect to find it next to you. It's nice. The way I feel around you, like, like I can be better. Yes. Do you maybe feel the same? Oh, okay. You know what? Go for it. Let's get a happy ending. Come on. I'm gonna kiss you now. All right, that's fair. I like this. That's what I wanted. I've missed this. Oh. Hold that thought. I was gonna say Alfred too. Is should... that what I think it is? Oh, this is awkward and creepy. What is my stuff doing on display in oh. your cave? You know, that is kind of creepy. Alongside mementos of the psychopaths you've locked up? Okay, I can explain. Not that you're normal by any stretch of the imagination, but uh, and there I am, right next to Harvey Dent. This has got to be good. Uh. Let's riz her up. Yours makes me smile. It remind me of you. Is that such a bad thing? Yes. That actually worked? Uh, did you want them back? Hold on to them. Are you serious? <laughs> I they can't believe that actually nice worked. There. Bro, that actually worked. I think he's crazy <laughs> if I was in her shoes, bro. <laughs> All right, let's see. Give me your secrets, Riddler. Should we be Defense doing this in the back here? Thank you, Alfred. Alfred, thank you. Wait, you forgot a cup for yourself? Come on, dude. No, 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 no. Get a. Hey, go make. I'd go get up, Bruce. Go make a cup for Alfred. No, we're not doing that. This. Hey, the USB can wait. We're. We go. Go get Alfred some tea. That's not cool. We're all family here now. Come on. Decryptor detected. Accessing Sanctus Project Lotus files. I really don't Retinal like how we're scan required. Yeah, I don't like doing this on the back. Let's computer. try this again. Boy, she made them. <laughs> Yikes! Access granted. Uncanny, bro. Bruce, whenever you have a moment, I have something to show you. Sure, yeah. Anytime for you, Al. The back computer will scan for viruses and other safeguards before we can have access to the data. I don't know. I, I don't trust the Batcave after everything with Lucius. I don't know why we keep bringing everything here. I'm not gonna lie. 
Let's check out Al. Come on. I'm very curious about that, but uh, talk to Alfred in your armory. I got you, dog. Let's keep going. All right, let's see. Let's talk to... Oh, yeah, let's talk to Selena and then Alfred. We'll talk to everyone. I don't think there's a time limit for that, would there be? I'd be really disappointed if there was. I mean, come on. My car is pretty sick. I love it. <sighs> it's over 600 horsepower. Oh, come on! We all have our own thing, okay? It's a good car! Man. Selena. All right. Where do we go from here? So, do you like the bad cave? <laughs> so, what do you think? There's a lot of interesting tech down here. How you did it all, I'll never know. And it's more hospitable than the abandoned subway those maniacs call home. But just barely. That's fair. All right. So... What do you think is next for us? I think we just started, Romantically so... Romantically or with Riddler's laptop? Oh. <laughs> I don't have a lot of expectations, but I do have some hope. Okay, that's fair. That's a weird question to ask. Just, I mean, like, uh, I don't know. I think Bruce and Catwoman would probably be an okay couple, but in the long run, I don't know. I'm just a little concerned on how that would work, to be honest, because they're two very different people. Like, you know, we don't even know Catwoman as a person, per se. Only just, like, some of the things that we did. So, we'll see. Thanks for the suit. Let's talk, Al. How you doing, buddy? I finished up a new feature for your contacts. Lucius nearly completed it before. But, well... I've been fiddling with it to keep myself occupied. Nice work. Uh, at any rate, your contacts now have the capability to detect heat signatures. Oh. Cold, too, because well, with Mr. Freeze, you never know. Thanks. I'm sure it'll come in handy. I'm impressed you felt close enough to someone to welcome them into the Batcave. But I'm curious to know why. <laughs> what is it about her? Not that I'm judging, mind you. Difficult to take it back at this point. But, um, well, maybe you should keep an eye on the more valuable items down here. <laughs> She's important to me. I thought as much. Good for you, Bruce. This is a big step. See, this is really sweet. I like these moments with Alfred. I hope there's more of that in this game. <sighs> it's done. Sounds like the laptop ah, is safe. Ah, come on! No, let's talk to Alfred more. I want to check in on him. I'm worried about you, buddy. No, yeah. <sighs> Hello. All right, how are you holding up? So, how are you holding up? Well, I'm ready and able to surf. <laughs> <laughs> well, you always are. I mean, like, how are you actually... What? Come on, missed opportunity. I want to bond with Alfred. My suit always takes a lot of damage, but it still does what it, it still does what it's supposed to do. Hide my identity, intimidate criminals, and keep me alive. Lucius gave me this upgraded model after the Battle of Lady Arkham of last year. The new suit has improvements, armament, shielding. Wait, shielding and scanning technology? Why aren't we wearing it then? The device to stop criminals cold with powerful electric shock. It's flashy, unsubtle, and guaranteed to incapacitate targets no matter what their size. That's cool. I like how we get to see all the back tech. Smoke grenades. You know what they do. Actually, what other tool is there? Or oh, batarangs. I like that. You can't beat the batarangs. Grappling hook. And the original suit. Okay, so this is the bat suit that was designed. Oh, sorry. This was this bat suit was damaged in our fight against Children of Arkham against Harvey Vent's preliminary troops. Oh, uh, okay. Lucius has given me a better version of the suit, and I hold on to this to remind me to never let my guard down in battle. That's cool. All right, that's awesome. I love seeing all that stuff. All right, now let's let's get to the computer. I am bothered though. Honestly, Al is such a cool character. I wish we got more time with him. I really, I really, I really like him. He's really good. And I feel kind of like a bad person for not being able to spend more time or check in on him, you know? At least, like, radio in and make sure he's okay, but... All right, come on, Riddler. Give me your secrets. And don't hack my bat cave, please. I shall be upstairs if you need me. Good luck. Thank you, thank you. Look at all this data. Finally, something we can read. Let's see what he knew. Okay. Patient 843. 10 milligram injection at 0.01% solution. Oh my god. Patient 844. 10 milligram injection at 0.015% solution. Hey, that guy. Wait! Unless you're using the same assets. God, what is that? 
human test subjects? Are you really surprised? We have to find what they were giving those test subjects. Yeah, that's what I'm more curious about. I, I'm more curious Invoices, on that. Voices, schematics, design notes. The fools think they know. Wait, the fools think they're safe. They're stupider than I thought if they think that, uh, that I'd ever forget what they did. If they think I'd forgiven them, I'm closing in on them now. I know who their supplier is, and I know... Sorry, and that means that I know that they moved on to their twisted operation. They're in Gotham, hiding in plain sight. Well, not for long. Interesting. Oh, is there any more? It doesn't scroll. Okay, I guess, I guess that's all that Riddler must have been talking about the location of the black side. His obsession with data left us an incredibly thorough paper trail. Look at these manifests. Bodhi Spa? Strange place for a delivery of virus incubators. This must be what Riddler means by hiding in plain sight. Probably. Probably. <laughs> Eve, dude! Oh no. Yep. Some kind of viral agent from the looks of things. A biological weapon. Another, Another one. one. This is what Harley wants. Oh. Agency. The agency. Don't you work with them? Amanda Waller. Okay, wait. Before we start talking, she power off the, the phone. Yeah, power off the phone. Sounds like you owe her a phone call. Yep. No, power off the phone. Why were you going to get, get the evidence, lock it down, and then question Waller? Why would you... Bruce. Give it to Gordy. Oh man. To what do I owe the pleasure of this call? The agency was working on a virus with human test subjects. Bruce, what on earth? I just saw it with my own eyes. How do you? Is that what Quinn's after? Yes, I found the black site, hiding in the middle of Gotham at the Bodhi Spa. Okay, okay. I promise we'll get to the bottom. Of no, this. I don't buy it. But I need you to trust me. I really don't. Meet me at Wayne Tower in 15. Seriously? I'll tell you what I know. No, I don't I don't like this at all. Set up. Harley was asking if the goggles are ready. I'll go back to the subway, see if I can keep her busy. Thank you, Thanks, thank you. Selena. Benefits of partners. Be safe, Bats. You too. Yeah, honestly, I'm more concerned about her, if anything. I'm gonna be fine no matter what I do. I got, I got plot armor. Ooh, the hive of villainy. All right, let's see what we can find. Oh crap, okay. Tiffany, what are you doing here? Running late today? I expected you earlier. I needed to talk to you, but you picked the worst I'm time. sorry, Bruce. What? This is for your own protection. What do you mean? <laughs> behind your back. On the floor, now! Wow. On the floor! Go, go! Oh God, this is set up by Waller, has to be. Bruce Wayne, you're under arrest for armed robbery, murder, and criminal conspiracy to commit a terrorist act. Dang. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney. I'll cooperate. Gentlemen, please. You have my full co- <clears throat> Shut your mouth and stay down! Don't hurt him! Uh, thanks for the call, Miss Fox. You've done a good thing today. You lied to me! You need to stand back. Well, we're gonna have a problem. Jeez. Bruce, I'm so sorry. I didn't expect them to be so violent. <laughs> I just wanted them to get you away from those nut jobs. <sighs> it's okay, it's my fault. Don't even put it on you. This is my fault. We will talk about this later. Don't even worry about it. What in the Oh Mr. Waller? This is too convenient. Uncuff Mr. Wayne right now, or you'll spend the rest of your life as a meter maid. This is a setup. Wait, whoa, no, okay. Mr. Wayne is under agency protection, and you know it. What? You've known it for some time. Waller and the agency, they're not always going to be around to save you, Wayne. One day, you're going to run out of favors to call in. And when you do, there'll be hell to pay. I promise you, Gordon, I'm trying to help. I'm not a criminal, Gordon. Oh, Officers, please. I... Oh. He's involved. He belongs in a cell. This is neither your concern or your purview. Go home, Gordon. 
You're done here. The hell I will! If I were you, I'd be very careful of my next words. And if I were you, I'd stop interfering with GCPD business. This is my city! Not anymore. Oh, no. You're so far out of line, you can't see the truth. You're dismissed. Oh, crap. Excuse me? You tested me. No, this okay. This is what happens. No, no, no. I'm done with Damn this it, power. Waller. You can't do this. It's well within my power and you know it. No, don't Waller. even. I said... No, this is, this is a power grab. No. Waller, Gordon is a good cop. He's a good man. Don't do this. Not from you. It's the last straw. I won't allow anyone to question my authority. This is strictly professional. Oh, sure. Time to go, Jim. That's not fair! Don't do Gordy like that. She must have knew that Gordon was coming in after us. There's no way. She used this to exercise her power, man. I don't trust- I don't trust Waller! Even if she helped! We'll make sure Gordon leaves and be right outside. <sighs> when you're ready. Thanks, Sylvester. Also, good work. I apologize for everything. <laughs> Calling the cops was a bit much. <laughs> That's okay. Let's talk. Well, you wanted a chance to talk to me, so here it is. Yeah, I'm really pissed off, but... Talk. Yeah. I just don't understand how you got tied up in all this. The agency? If I had known you were... What are you doing with them? Please, just tell me, Bruce. This sucks. I Look, Tiffany, I'm an undercover operative. What I'm doing, it's dangerous. Thank you for telling me. Mm. I see now, though. This is why he's dead. He was involved in whatever you're doing. Yeah, sorry about this that. work you're doing seems incredibly dangerous. It very much But is. there's something I don't get. Hmm? Why you? I mean, no offense, but... Yo. You're just... Bruce. <laughs> this is awesome. I'm Batman. <laughs> I'm Batman. You're Batman. The Batman. Come on. I got something to show you. Yeah, come on. Honestly, let's do it. I love this. Hey, Bruce. Wanted to show you a preview of your new bat suit. I know you and Alfred are still on your well-deserved retreat, but I couldn't help myself. Oh, this is not fair to her, though. Dad. I'll upload the specs to your private server. No! Alright, hope you oh. guys are enjoying yourselves. I'll see you soon. That's not fair. Why did I pick that recording out of everything? No, okay. It um, was hard to believe. But hearing it from him. Yeah, your dad was pretty badass. I'm not going to lie. Your dad was a hero. Your dad believed the city deserved better. He believed in me. And to think I gave him lip for missing dinner sometimes. No, that's fair. You had every right to. Dad gone. Maybe I can still help. If... Oh. That man is interested. Ah, do Gets I the least I can do. And I know my dad would be proud. Okay, You'll need well, the proper training. Yeah, I it's guess. It's a dangerous job. It's very dangerous, but... Whatever it takes, I'm in. I mean, yeah, she went this That's far. That's good to hear. Yeah, I feel like she would have okay. done it I anyway. Okay, I to digest. Sorry for everything earlier, but thank you for trusting me with this. Yeah. I mean, I'm only saying we might be pushing him too hard. Oh, he's capable and he knows how to cover his tracks. Our only path forward is through Wayne. Okay. No, <clears throat> hold on. Oh, let's get to it then. I know you have some questions. Yeah. A few. Care to explain why the videos I saw said this virus was an agency experiment? Years ago, I was brought in to rectify the agency's past mistakes. Or failing that to cover them up. One mess in particular dealt with black ops experiments. Human subjects. The kind of amoral science that makes your skin crawl. Sanctus. 
They were a division that was shut down for good <laughs> oh long before either of us joined. Yeah, right. But evidently, they went underground. This is our worst case scenario. With Sanctus off the leash, this research poses a global threat. If I'd known where they set up their den, I would have taken them out years ago. Okay, well then here's your chance to bring them in. If you want them taken out, now's your chance. We know right where they are. It's not that simple. Nope, it is. It's Sanctus quite simple. Sanctus was dangerous then. They're certainly worse now. Yeah, I don't buy it. This whole situation. It's given me an idea. Oh, conveniently. I can't put an agent within a thousand yards of that place without them starting a war or blowing up the entire block just to cover their tracks. We know it's tricky, but leading Harley and her gang into Sanctus might allow the two problems to take care of themselves. Oh my god. They have Riddler's info. They have a way in. And you're undercover with them. You're gonna use the At least the with Sanctus and the pact at each other's throats, the agency can act quickly, clean up, and minimize casualties. Yeah. It's unorthodox. But a strike like this will keep damage from spilling onto Gotham Street. Look, it's not a bad plan. It's just they're Makes unpredictable, sense. you know? Why endanger anyone else when I have my own personal wrecking crew? My thoughts, exactly. Look, for now, just go and check this place out. Right now, as yourself. We don't want them to know Batman is on their tail. I bet you're the type of guy who has some expensive surveillance equipment. We have your back, Bruce. We'll be right behind you. Okay. Keep me in the loop so I know what my team and I might be facing when it goes down. Urgh! Defenses, security, whatever. Their lives are in your hands, Bruce. I can see that. As well as the fate of this city. I know you might have reservations about working with Harley and her crew like this. Sometimes you have to use bad people to do good things. I have reservations against you right now, to be honest. I'm just doing this because I need to figure out what's going on with all the Sanctus stuff. Like, if you're not going to tell me, I'll just dig it up myself. Honestly. Let's do this. Al? Have you located the black site? I think so. While you were at the office, I did some basic online research on the Bodhi Spa. Excellent. What's the verdict? According to reviews, it truly seems to be a fully functioning business. Uh, not just a front. Oh. Can't tell from the service entrance. They offer rather popular high-end massages and have an active social media feed. It's a 24-hour business, Bruce. There are customers going in and out at all times. Hmm. So is their suppliers, right? They have no idea what's coming for them. No innocent collateral damage. No, just innocent people, Bruce. I'll have to keep everyone who runs that facility out of harm's way. This is gonna be hard. Initiate the feed of my contacts to Waller. Let her know I'm here. At once. We need to see what we're up against. Good idea. Remember, you're able to toggle the thermal imaging in your lenses. I'm signing off while you speak with Director Waller. All right. Be careful. Always. You too. Thanks, Al. Waller? On the line, Bruce. I'm here. I'll let you know if I find anything interesting. Caution is key, Bruce. This situation is a spark away from a wildfire. I'll keep that in mind. Cool, I was gonna say. I love the fact that we got those dope contacts. Oh god, but they look creepy when looking at them. Jeez. Okay, let's scan the imagery. Huh. Project Lotus. This is definitely the place. Bodhi Spa. Yeah, we shouldn't be just walking in here too much. They weren't exactly being subtle. Oh, whoa, 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 hold on, what? Oh. We can see the electrical panels and everything, too. Whoa, okay, that's cool. I didn't know that we had a filter. Use the D-pad to isolate temperatures. see a security panel inside the building. It could trigger an alarm system of some kind. If I can hit that before they suspect what I'm really here for. They'll be blind and helpless. Perfect for my people. You just saved a few agents' lives, Bruce. Okay, cool. Well, let's keep it in check. Hold on, there's gotta be more than just one security panel. Seriously, is there nothing else? Oh no, the, okay, it stops over here. So then let's examine. Must be some kind of guard, maybe, or a customer. Wait, what? Heading downstairs. The real lab must be underground. Sanctus has been in the middle of Gotham this entire time. 
They burrow under your skin and eat you from the inside out. This is why I'm willing to let these criminals be the tip of the spear. Dangerous and expendable. My favorite adjectives. <laughs> okay, let's see. I don't think that that's important, appears though. to just be a patron. Oh, okay. I was... Okay. It would have been funny if there was, like, some secret thing. Whoa! Hold on. Someone's print? There are still traces of heat signatures. Someone was here recently. Maybe guards. Mm, let's see, then. Heat pipes. Some heat pipes. We look so shady, like, examining this entire place from the outside. Looks like we have a receptionist behind the front desk. She's hardly anything to worry about. All too easy to hide a gun under that desk. Yeah, this is true. Okay, did we examine everything? I, I think we've examined everything at this point. Let's just double check. I don't see any other line work or anything possible in the area that could kind of tip us off aside from that elevator there. All right. Oh, we have to look in normal vision. Maybe there's something on the outside that we can utilize. Yeah, look at the access door. That access door is connected to the spa. Yeah, I didn't need the That's goggles for that one. field work, Bruce. I know being undercover's been tough, but you just need to maintain it a little longer. If you don't get inside with those maniacs, we're going to have a pandemic on our hands. Yep. Waller, I need to go. Now, why would a billionaire be skulking around in a filthy alley? Oh, come on, Bane. You do your research. Carefully inspecting every detail. Almost as if performing reconnaissance. Oh, I have an appointment. Bad shoulder. The main entrance is around the corner. That's not why you're here. Dang it! My Bane, have you been spying on me? Spying? No. I've only been keeping an eye on you. That's the same thing. I heard the GCPD paid you a visit at your office, so I swung by to see if you might be in need of some aid. Oh no. Innocent as that. Then. Something about the look on your face as you left. So, determined. Yes, I had a sense you would lead me to something interesting. Oh no. Project Lotus. This is the secret you and Harley had. Where are we, Bruce? What is this place? Okay, we gotta come clean for it. This sucks. And do your best, to be honest. Lies insult us both. Yeah, no, let's go for it. Give him a little bit, and then I'll get him off our this backs. This is it. The black site Riddler wanted to hit. So this is what Harley was trying to keep secret. She didn't know. <laughs> Strange that you're here after a run-in with GCPD in an alleyway with the other rats. Finding you in this duplicitous position while we have a mole problem, well, it does not look good for you, my friend. Yeah, I didn't expect as much. When you wake up, you can tell Harley that you led me right to her conspiracy. Oh, no. Wait, what? Wake up. <laughs> oh, there it is. Dang it. Ah. Christ crap. and shine. This sucks. You suck, Bane. Should have said Harley sent me. Harley! What the horses? Oh, I pity what you're about to face, Wayne. I pity you, man. You did the right thing, telling me about the black site. But there's still something about you that gives me pause. Something that casts a shadow over your heart. Oh, no. Harley wanted to spearhead the hunt for the mole. This will be her chance. Yep. So, be thoughtful with your words in there. They could be your last. I'm not really worried, but thanks for the advice. Harley, trust me. Thanks for the warning. Thanks for the warning. I'll be careful. I hope it's not you, Wayne. God. But if it is, 
I'll kill everyone who shows up for your funeral. Dang, bro. Whoa! What is it now, Bane? The rat has been uncovered. Wayne was right under your nose. I tracked Wayne to the location of the black site. And if he had I a... sent Wayne to scout it, so lower your damn voice. There. It was the final piece of the puzzle, and now we got it. Go get your boys ready. We move on the site ASAP. And don't worry your pretty little head about our rat problem. I got it covered. Oh, no. Okay. And Bane, tell Freeze to get one of them popsicle makers ready. Thank you. You're not going anywhere. You're in here. With me. Yep. Okay. I'm dead. I'm dead. R.I.P. Boys, take care of Alfred for me. It rhymed. You know it's true. Thanks for backing me up. Don't mention it. Can't have him stepping on my turf, you know? I said I'd find the rat, and I will. Okay, perfect. Your father, he was a hard man, right? Someone lied to him, betrayed him. He ended them. Think he was onto something with that idea? Show no mercy, take no apologies, that sort of thing? Ah. There's always another way. Killing someone isn't an answer. The son of Thomas Wayne shies away from spilling blood. Oh no. You are who I think you are, Bruce. Who do you think I am? A man out to prove to the underworld he's just as bad as his dear departed dad. Uh, oh, okay. Or there are more to the story I should know. Oh no. Hidden depths? Secrets you Why? don't want me to see? Well, I enjoy walks on the beach. I also enjoy long walks on the beach. And the park. Hmm. <laughs> You're funny. Must have gotten that from your mother's side. You know, my dad could be a funny guy, too. Okay, just chill. She's just testing and us. And they all fell down To the deep to drown To the dark to drown Cause you're not a clown Does that he rhyme? He used to sing that to me. My dad. Oh. Made me feel safe. Like nothing could hurt me. You have a nice voice. You have a nice voice. <laughs> Might want to get those ears checked, Brucey. What's left of them? Everyone's calling me out for that. <laughs> Dude. But it's nice to know I have a fan. Been running short of those lately. Hmm. In fact, you being like my dad, that's why I got such a soft spot for you. Oh, oh. you do? You found me the black site, didn't you? Mm -hmm. Plus... You're not a bad guy. Well, thank you. I mean, you. you're rotten like the rest of us. But you actually care for some people. Like that girl John told me about. <sighs> oh, no. What's her face? Uh, Brittany? Oh, no. No. Tiffany. You remember? Early 20s, fresh faced and optimistic. Oh, no. Why would I say that? Don't say anything. Tiffany, who's that? Doing? Who's, who's that? <laughs> oh. That's rich. <laughs> nice try, but you're a book. Yeah, Ever I didn't like those you. options. I would have been like Tiffany. I'm glad you have a friend in this world, Bruce. That's invaluable. Yeah, friends are great. Except when yep. you have to lose them. There it is. Laptop's gone. What? What are you? Yeah, Shaka, we have a turncoat. Oh. Whew. I've interviewed just about everyone in the place. Except maybe one. Or two. So gosh, that only leaves the two people I haven't cleared. Oh no. You and Catwoman. Of course. Maybe it was the guy who Bane gave the hamburger face. But weirdest thing, the laptop went missing after that. Uh... Well, you must have missed something. Catwoman and I are loyal. Oh, okay. I guess I'll take your word for it. Spoiler no, that's alert. not how that works. I ain't taking your word for it. John, get in here! Oh, no. When I told Puddin I narrowed it down to you two, he begged me to let him interrogate you. I gave him some pointers. Okay. And now this is his chance. Okay. Hi, Bruce. You potential rat. Oh, come on. Have at it, John. 
Oh. <sighs> Harley, uh, do you mind? Okay. At least I died Can't knowing. Can't learn to ride with training wheels on forever, you know. I'll be right outside. Perfect. At least I'll die knowing I gave you a chance to riz somebody. Go for Admit it. Admit it, you rat scum. You're the. the rat. <clears throat> Oof. Oh man. Sorry. What? I have to make it sound good. Oh. Okay. No, hit me again. Do it again. What? Do it. Hit me again. Take that. <clears throat> You're hitting him already. Huh. I'll let it play. Keep going. Keep going. <sighs> I never wanted it to come to this. Yeah, bro, I know. But we both know what has to be done. Catwoman has to take the fall. Think about it, Bruce. Harley's gonna kill that no. Tiffany girl if it's you. I'm not gonna throw it to John. Who knows if she'll stop there? Can't, bro. There is no scenario where we are letting that That's happen. like me telling you to give I up Harley. I can't do it. be a knee-jerk reaction, but this is the only way out. Bro. The only way that keeps you alive. Did you even stick up for me? Yeah, he did. I Come on. Lie, Bruce. I really did. I said it loud and clear. I internally. Oh. <laughs> you know Harley. She's not a mind reader. I'm sorry. Not as strong as you. Bro, you don't have to be stronger. I'll, I'll get through this, Bruce, but I don't see a lot of options that end too great for you. It's either you or her. What do you want to do, Bruce? She knows it was one of you two. She knows. I gotta guess it was Catwoman. I went to the safe, but it was already gone. And you were right there talking to Harley, so... I know... You care about her, but yeah. Bro. All right, time's up. Oh, dang Perfect. it. Because I'm done. You got a confession? Great job, Wooden. <sighs> Who are we hanging out to dry? Go ahead, Bruce. Tell her what you told me. Oh, God. I'm sorry, buddy. Come on. Go ahead, Bruce. It's okay. Just like we talked about. <laughs> Please. It was me, Harley. I took it. I'm sorry, buddy. I can't have people dying. You were just starting to get under my skin. Oh, no. Too bad. I guess I do have to hurt Tiffany after all. There it is. And you, of course. I knew you had it in you, John. We are going to do terrible things together. <sighs> I'm happy like, for you, but... send this one to the great icebox in the sky. Dang. Oh my god, you gotta be joking me. It's okay. Bro, that sucks. Maybe we can activate the EMP or something. Oh no, dude. Well, Bruce, it's been fun. Bane, get him inside. Dang. Oh! There it is! I'm Han Soloed. You can let the cats out of the bag. Mm. Bruce. Nope, don't Bruce worry about it. Is in deep trouble. Harley, be reasonable. <laughs> Why would I start now? I got you what you wanted. I found the black. Side. This ain't about what it was or mm. what you did with it. It's about trust. Oof. And I ain't got none for you no more. Eesh. Wait. Harley, as great as this is as a punishment, not Bruce. You can't. Aw. He's, he's, he's my best friend. John's too awesome. John's amazing. I, okay. Aw, Puddin. That's sweet. So, maybe we can let him go? Live, at least? Aw, oh, man. Thank you for trying. Nah. Okay. Be sure to send Tiffany a postcard from Antarctica. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Maybe there's a way I can break out EMP or something. Come on. There's gotta be something. <laughs> oh, no way. Are you serious? Oh, that's it. Oh. No way. That's the end of episode three. Fractured. Wow. Okay. Now I'm curious to see what everyone else did. That episode was awesome. Deceived! 
Oh God, so true. You and 70.4% of players left Harley feeling deceived. She was unconvinced by your defense that you weren't being the mole. She was unimpressed by your stance on dealing with traitors, and she felt deceived when you confessed to having the mole, having been the mole the entire time. That is totally fair, and that totally sucks. Sorry, Harley, but uh, I don't know. Maybe I think the I think the the stance with the traitor part when I went to go check on him. Maybe that definitely was uh, something different. But we'll see. Remorseful, yeah, Gordy. You know what? Hey, before you guys come at Gordy with all this stuff, you can't really blame him. He really didn't want Waller in the city, and he was losing control of everything. Mind you, we don't even know everything just because of how much Waller has kind of hid from him. Like, she was one-to-one -one with us, but I don't know. And I don't really trust Waller fully. I don't know. I just I just don't. I don't feel, I don't feel like with Project Sanctus and everything that all of a sudden she's on our side. I feel like she's doing this to cover everything up, you know, and then using Bruce as a reason to. Um, so... Furious, you and 70.4% did something that will make Waller furious. She felt forgiven when you accepted her apology at the convoy. She felt as if you two were growing accustomed to one another when you agreed to use your plans for villains for good. But she will, oh, she will be furious that you gave up your cover. Dude, our cover was already given up. There is no other way. I, I think it was just a test, honored. I mean, yeah, I think Tiffany had to know, although I do, I do feel a little uncomfortable kind of letting her join us right off the bat. I want to keep her distanced, you know, if, if anything, so. Catwoman, horrified. Wow. Okay, she was grateful that you warned her to help her evade the GCPD. She felt honored that you let her see the Batcave, and you gave yourself up. Yeah, when you gave yourself, she felt horrified watching. See what happened to you? She worried that you might die. That is fair. And you know what? I like the I like the whole Bruce and Catwoman thing. Um, I I'm not really into like the romance of characters in most video games, but eh, that was that wasn't bad. I liked it. You know. Uh, we got still two episodes, so I know with plot armor we're gonna make it, but dang, I wasn't expecting them to freeze us. Um, so let's see. No! No, okay, you know what? John was the best part of this entire episode. I loved him so much. He took heart on your advice to be genuine. He felt sorry for letting you down. His, oh, when his, here, okay. He felt down for letting you down. Sorry. Oh, God, I can't even speak because I, I loved it. Anyway, he felt sorry for letting down his hero when he couldn't retrieve the laptop. Bro, no. You did everything you could. Because you sacrificed yourself to protect your friends, he felt completely guilt-ridden. And you know what? That's not on you, bro. You really tried. You came in clutch. You really did. Did you warn Catwoman? Yeah, okay. You know what? I'm curious. Okay, for the people that actually, the 38.6% that actually warned, or sorry, chose not to warn Catwoman, what actually happens in it? Did we, were we able to secure the laptop or was John able to? Like, did he feel more confident after that? I wonder. Um, when you gave dating advice to John in the cafe, did you help attract Harley's attention? Yeah, it, I think it was, the coaching seemed to be the most hilarious option in this entire game. I really enjoyed that. It was really fun. Let's see here. Did you tell Tiffany that you're Batman? Yeah. You know what? To the 17.6% that didn't, I'm curious to see what you, why you didn't choose to tell her. Was it because it would put it in danger or something? I'm, I'm, I'm intrigued by that. Let's check. Did you out yourself as the mole? Yeah, I think, I think it was just better to out ourselves in that situation. Only just because one plot armor and number two, I don't know. I feel like throwing Catwoman into the freezer, they possibly could have done it worse. You know, something else is there to that. So let's see. Plus, I didn't want anyone to die. I'd rather it be me. Okay, let's see. Those were good stats. Whew. Okay, episode three was really good. You guys weren't joking. This this was this was pretty epic. I really enjoyed this episode. I, I okay. I, I'll finish the other ones and give my honest uh, ranking for all the episodes. But I'm leaning on this one so far with all the choices that we had as Bruce. A shocking revelation. Oh wait, what ails you? A shocking revelation forces Bruce into a desperate change of plans as a oh, as the villain's lethal plot escalates. Okay. Either way, I love the fact that the images are uncovering as we go. We got two more episodes. And if anything, thank you guys so much for slowing down and providing your support. Uh, love reading the comments. I loved reading interactions. And you know what? The best part is reading about how everyone had different versions of Alfred was kind of surprising because I, I wasn't expecting like a vengeful Alfred being an option. Either way, I won't take up any more of your time. If anything, thanks for slowing down. Take care, stay safe, and we'll be jumping into the next episode, episode four, What Ails You Next. So without further ado, I give you the Batman. Ooh, I tried making it rhyme, never mind. Either way, take care, stay safe, guys. Thanks for slowing down.